East Day 23 ABC told you about a couple arrested in Cayucas, a small town near Morro Bay. And tonight, the neighbor of the two suspects is speaking out about what she noticed the night that the couple packed up to leave. 23 ABC's Alexa Ray spoke with the neighbor earlier today. Alexa. Darwin Alaskari and Sherry Bodges were arrested yesterday while police say they were in the process of transporting a dead body along with illegal narcotics and their 13 year old daughter. When arrested, they told police that they were transients. However, a neighbor of theirs noticed them on TV last night. We were just concerned because, you know, something happened, it happened here. You know, and nobody wants to talk about it. According to Darlene Glenn, a neighbor to Darwin Alaskari and Sherry Bodges, they lived in a trailer park located on South Union Avenue. Also living in that trailer was their 13-year-old daughter, another man, and an older man who Glenn was told was Bodges' father. A week from this past Saturday, Glenn noticed that the couple was packing up to move with the 13-year-old girl. However, they didn't see Bodges' father with them. We had noticed the, the van being in there already that morning, but when... I was coming through and another neighbor had seen them load up something wrapped in a sheet and it looked very heavy. And then they put all their other belongings inside that U-Haul van. Something about the missing father seemed off. And there was a smell that we smelled what days before they had gotten the van. And it smelled like something dead. The U-Haul was being pulled by a vehicle, something that the couple didn't own. They say the trailer they were living in still has a resident. The man that moved in with them is still living there. And we noticed that things were cleaned up. No license plates on the vehicles back there. So there is definitely something going on. After seeing the events last night on the news and realizing what happened, Glenn feels unsafe living where she has for so long. We're just afraid for ourselves. We don't know what's happening. And it to be so close to our back doors or our front doors, it, it scares you. It really does. According to San Luis Obispo County, the couple hasn't been charged with anything relating to the body in the car until they find out whether foul play occurred. A court date has not been set yet. In the Live Center, Alexa Ray, 23 ABC.